Ladies and gentlemen, I am Foxgear92. And let me just start this video with a big FUCK YOU to Pat Robertson. I'm going to be showing you a video and putting it piece by piece instead of showing you the whole thing because that just makes it easier. This is from Kat, who says, I'm really concerned about my 16-year-old daughter. I found out recently that she's having an intimate relationship with another girl. <laughs> I don't approve of this behavior, so I tried to keep her home, but that didn't work. I wonder fucking why. Now she's just plain rebelling. <laughs> rebelling. <laughs> okay, you're trying to stifle her sexuality, and that you know, she's rebelling. She's, she's rebelling. <laughs> I don't know. She's re she's rebelling. She's not doing what we want. Therefore, she's rebelling. It doesn't matter that her biology doesn't, you know, want her to do what we want her to do. But uh, she's rebelling. I don't know. How can I regain control of this situation and help her know that I do love her? Tell her you love her, and that you accept her for what she is. <gasps> Mind blowing, huh? Um, you need to do a lot of praying about that one. Dear Jesus, please let my daughter stop being a homosexual. You know, the attachment, I understand, the lesbian relationship <clears throat> is very, very strong. I bet you do. And uh, she probably thinks that she's in love with this girl. Yeah, thinks. She, she thinks. She thinks. She, she's not. She just thinks she is. And um, there, there, there's an emotional bond there. What maybe counseling will work uh, more than anything. You need to have God intervene. The other alternative is to take up and move somewhere. But the question is, are you really a lesbian? Or don't you have any feeling at all for members of the opposite sex? What is what is the deal going on? You know, teenagers aren't quite sure of their sexual identity. Now I will go along with that. Teenagers aren't quite sure of their sexual identity. Sometimes it's just kind of this way or that way. They're experimenting and that's fine. But you're still a cunt. And sometimes she's into this because she didn't know any better. And this is the easy way. Oh, fuck you. Th that's the easy way? Are you fucking kidding me? Have you seen how homosexual? Of course you fucking seen how homosexuals are fucking treated in the fucking United States of America. You have seen this. You have contributed to this. Fucking easy way. Oh, fucking suck my fucking cock. Um, so uh, she might grow out of it, but you you need counseling. You need a professional counselor on this one. The only counselor she could possibly see would be a Christian counselor. Because if she went to a real counselor, they would tell the parents to fuck off, wouldn't they? No, you mean take her to a shame therapist, to make her ashamed of herself, to make her ashamed of what she was born as. That's what you're suggesting. That's what you want. Now, Robbie, can I call you Robbie? I'm going to call you Robbie. Robbie, we don't choose what sexuality we are. We do not choose to be a sexuality where a massive amount of people are going to discriminate against us, humiliate us, pass laws through re legislation taking away basic freedoms. We don't choose this. Cliché incoming. We're born this way. Yeah, fucking amazing, isn't it? And oh, I'm so sorry that your God doesn't like it. But guess what? Your God can go fuck himself. Just saying. Fox Gear 92. Peace out.